G'day everyone, John Larder here with a quick update. Well, here we have another disgrace. George's River Council, you should be absolutely bloody ashamed of you, yourselves. You're a pack of mongrels. Fannigan, I've been on the council now in Snowy Valley for uh, uh, nearly three terms. I can't believe this sort of garbage is going on. King Carlos Coffee in Hurstville, great local business. Um, and here I am supported by uh, a great friend of mine, uh, Steve Small, former New South Wales cricketer and uh, New South Wales cricket coach. Jack, isn't this an absolute disgrace? Three grand, three grand. This bloke has been absolutely nailed by these bureaucrats during um, COVID. Uh, has had to comply with all this absolute COVID fraud. And here we are now, a $3,000 fine mm. for putting this trailer here. I mean, fair dinkum, these people are a disgrace. Well, it's hard enough to put uh, food on the table these days, Johnny, without uh, having this sort of uh, stuff, you know, hold you back. And you know, Carlos is—he's a bloke who works seven days a week, and um, yeah, very disappointing. What do you reckon, Carlos? I mean, how do you cope after this? I mean, you're just here trying to make a go selling coffee, yeah. and you get that in the mail. Well, mate, three thousand dollars is a lot of coffees to be selling to, to try to pay this fine. Yeah, where we're trying to—we're we're, we're trying to make some money after COVID, after all the lockdowns. Yeah. How are we to do that? And not only that, please. Chris Mins, Dominic Perrottet, I mean, you're happy to put your billboards over every telegraph pole, over every, everywhere you drive in Sydney, right. there's, a, there's a political A-frame, isn't there? Yeah. I mean, and poor old Carlos, three grand. You just couldn't make this stuff up, guys. It's an absolute disgrace. Uh, ben Fordham, uh, 2GB, you need to get onto this. This is an absolute farce.